let's now continue with our progression of championship mode, as we have now done six events. And the next one we are going to do is this, the BMW M5 Autumn Hill Climb. And I'd assume because we already have the BMW M5, we don't get any rewards from this. So, the track is called Alpine Trail. Continue your path to the championship by tackling two laps of the mountain at Alpine Trail against seven other BMW M5 drivers. The only way to advance and unlock events 11 and 12 is to place first. So basically, it's winner-takes-all. Understood and confirmed. What isn't confirmed, however, is what colour I'm going to drive this thing in. don't really want to drive this thing in white. Hmm. Let me think. Yeah, why not? This will work. It's dark, but it's not too dark. It's also because, well, I recently drove a car in black, so... Uh, I don't think it's uh, really worth it for me to uh, use the same colours again. Same description as before. And, yep. This is definitely a... This is definitely a summit, because... I can see the cable cars, and same competition as with the previous event we did, and yeah, let's do this. Let's go! And we begin here at Alpine Trail. Yeah, that was a pretty obvious shortcut, judging by what I could tell at least. There was definitely something that told me it was advisable for me to take that shortcut. And as a result, I'm immediately up into third. And now I just have to figure out how to get into first. Which hopefully won't take too long. Still, I gotta say, the Beamer is fast. If there's one word I can use to describe this thing, it would definitely have to be fast, and I mean bad fast. And giving the leader a little bit of a nudge there. I wasn't crashing him, I was just giving him a little nudge to take over the lead. Oh, we've got three consecutive hairpins here. <laughs> you know, this kind of reminds me of Monaco, in a way, because... Technically speaking, Monaco does have... Three consecutive hairpins. More or less. If you think about it from this sketch. And I can definitely say avoiding the walls is not going to get any easier. And I just missed another obvious shortcut. Well, I missed a pretty obvious shortcut. Hopefully this will not take me too long to win. If I do lose this. But hopefully I won't. But anyway. Just gotta keep myself in the fight. As long as I'm running strong, then... I don't really care as long as I win in the end. Because that's what I need to do in order to progress. He's gone a little bit wide there into the corner. A little bit of contact there. And another shortcut this time I will not miss. And... Most of us wind up taking the shortcut, and we benefited from it also. 
which is interesting. But anyway. This is a pretty long track, I'm not gonna lie. And I just hit a rock. And... I did not see what exactly the horn button was, but I'd assume it's going to be one of the uh, toggle sticks, or analog sticks if you will. Anyways, back up into the lead, I'm now on 11,000 NFS points from this race alone. Got a poor exit there, but it's okay, because this is a pretty long track, and we've got plenty of time to make up for the ground we might have lost. I'd also imagine we're going to be driving supercars around here fairly soon. Hopefully it won't be too soon, but I'd imagine we'll definitely be driving supercars around here fairly soon, the way I see it. And... Just trying to keep my car under control here. I know winning this race is not going to be guaranteed because of how close it's been. And stepping on the brakes there so I can keep the car under my wings. And yep. If I wasn't going to overshoot the corner, someone was going to force me to overshoot the corner. What an asshole. Oh wait, okay, that was Ashley. Yeah, he definitely attempted a dive bomb that was never going to work. Because I was already too deep into the corner, and yet he was basically attempting to go for a gap that wasn't there. He was basically trying to pull off a Senna on me, if you will, and I'm so glad that worked because the leader did not take the lead away from me, or whoever that was, he was about to take the lead away from me, but because I got loose and I blocked him, he did not take the lead. I'm also pretty sure this spiral reminds me Kind of like Autumn Ring in a way, you know, from uh, from the Gran Turismo series. It does kind of remind me of Autumn Ring. There's definitely some reference points here to other tracks in other racing games I'm familiar with, or have played, if you will. I also know that this car is quite loose. I know that this car is not as agile as those other ones I've driven so far in the game, but if I can just keep my car straight and if I can just keep my car straight for long enough, this race should be mine. And Victory. Place first. Victory in the BMW well M5. Done. You have just won the BMW M5 Autumn Hill Climb. Yeah, what he said. We have won the BMW M5 Hill Climb. So, yep, finished in first. And those are your race results. Won by a second over Wayne. Mika completes the podium, Ashley fourth, followed by Dom in fifth. One was sixth ahead of Alexis, and Liv has still not managed to avoid finishing last. Sucks to be her, I guess. Anyways, doesn't matter because I win. You've set a new record for this track. Wow. You beat the best time for this track. Wow. I am totally not surprised. Okay, let's get our replay. I think I've wasted enough time with my uh, 
Saki tones. Let's see if we can get some decent shots of our beamer. I also believe this is the only BMW in the game. That could just be me, but I think this is the only BMW in this game. I also know this car was in high stakes as well. Not doing too badly so far. I mean, it still seems to cut straight back to the front and rear view. It still seems to have a habit. Oh, yeah, I broke off the mirror there. It still seems to have a habit of cutting bait. Cutting basically to the front and rear chase cams when I don't think it needs to, but again, that could just be me. Hmm, I'll give this another 10 seconds. Okay, we're done. Another one bites the dust. I'm also pretty sure that's a Queen song. Anyway, yeah. Event number seven is down. And we basically win nothing, unfortunately. But it doesn't matter because another event is done, and next time we will be doing the General Motors time trial. Although, I suppose whilst I'm here I might as well show off the car, if I haven't done so already. Yeah, here it is. Yeah. Even though we don't win it, this is the BMW M5. Oh yeah, I just remembered. There's this as well as the Z8 in terms of the two BMWs this game has. I literally just remembered that. My apologies. Anyway. Seven events are down and still many more to go. Next up will be the GM time trial. Same hot pursuit time, same hot pursuit channel. <laughs> 